Hey everybody, so I have a brand new game. Well, I say brand new, it's obviously not new, but I have NASCAR 99 for us, which funnily enough I actually got for 99p. So let's have a look and see what it's all about, shall we? I've uh, just done a quick test race and it didn't go well. Let's um, delete. Oh no, I don't have a season saved. Cancel that. New season, or a new season. Uh, we will be the cornflakes car. I like the cornflakes car. We'll go for that. Everything turned on. And done. And then done on that one. I ended up having to turn off the music. We don't want to watch that. I've already seen that, and it's those guys going on about cheesy things like saying consistency three times over. Now, I am far from a hardcore NASCAR, NASCAR fan. I really like how it gives you control, like right in the middle of the corner. Highly annoying. Oh god. I can't seem to find the best view to use. This is really disorientating. Ugh. Not a fan of the old uh, old in-car views. Also were nice to have. It, was, it disorientates me too much. Don't know what that lap time was. Or where we were, because it doesn't particularly say. But let's head to the race. I'm probably dead last. Oh no, 20 second. It's giving me control in the corner again. Don't do that, please. Oh god. It's like, like, oh god, this is not a good start. I caught that guy's slipstream halfway around the corner there. This is, uh, very different from those car games I've been playing lately. I checked out the reviews for this game. Oh wow, I went in way too hard there before I actually bought this and uh, they said it was a good game apart from the graphics aren't anything to write home about and um, I would definitely agree with that. I'm not used to where these corners are. Ugh. Hey, we're going to finish another lap. No, we're not. We're halfway around the lap. Ugh. I'm going to end up killing the car in a minute. That's what I did last time. I got like two laps done and then <laughs> ran in the back of someone and completely destroyed the car. Oh, wow. Oh, this has not gone well. I've brought you out of the race. Wow, this is... um. <laughs> a bit difficult, I must say. Well, that's a good start. Not used to. Oh, well, there's only 24 cars. Okay, I thought I was expecting 43. I'm the only person that didn't actually score. Or did I score? Oh no, I did score. Interesting. Las Vegas. Let's. Uh, I can't. Um, go to track, sure. Oh, that actually loads the track. Okay. I was going to say, let's turn down the damage. But. I don't think I can. So that's nice. I feel like I definitely need to turn down the damage. I like how you don't actually get, like the view you expect until it's time to go. It's kind of annoying. No, I can't change anything in terms of difficulty now I've started the season. So this is going to be fun. I'm not too bad on my own. It's when you get other cars in the mix. That's when things start to become a problem. Uh, come on car. You can turn. 
much, probably about what time I'm actually aiming for. It's probably way off. No, I don't think I'll too far off actually. Yeah, ninth. That's pretty good. Off we go. Gentlemen, start your engines. What row are we on? Four, five? Yeah, five. What's that guy doing? Well, at least this is a nicer um, turn to start the race on. Not as sharp as the last track. Ugh, I'm getting slipstream from miles back. That's uh, it's not ideal. There is somebody near me. Looks like I'm doing crazy speeds. Whee! Let's see if I can actually finish a race, that'd be nice. Well, yep, still getting the slipstream. Slow at this lap as well. I think I'm holding people up. Wow. Some nice rubber banding going on there. Clearly braking and turning is not ideal. When I first started the game, I was like, yeah, I'll put damage on because it probably won't be too difficult. Turns out I was quite wrong in that. So we don't seem to be making much progress over. Kind of still, still in ninth. Three laps down. Well, uh, not three laps down, but three laps complete. Kind of getting used to things. There's definitely people behind me, but I don't know if there's a look back key to see. No anti lock brakes here. Yeah, I'm definitely. No, dear. So good. Now I'm in the corner all wrong. Definitely losing time to these guys, which isn't good. You'll, uh, you'll have to let me know if you want me to continue this series. I might just kind of do it on the side, away from the main two that I've got going with Metal Gear Solid and Hollow in the, in the Dark. Because I know um, Hollow in the Dark is probably close to being finished now. But I don't actually have anything to replace it yet, so this may end up doing so. Wow, we are losing a lot of time here. Let's, let's see if we can start getting into these corners a bit quicker. Yeah, running out wide, very wide. Hey, it was a bit of lap. Four seconds. How did I go that quick on my first lap? It's probably because I had slipstream from the guys ahead of me. I need to uh, try and kind of push the car a bit more. Oh god, it's struggling. There we go. Yeah, it's definitely on the streets I'm losing time. I've kind of lost the guys ahead of me now, so I'm probably going to struggle to actually stay with them. Especially if I'm doing things like that. It's far from ideal. About 20 laps to go. Oh god. 
don't have any pit stops, mainly because the races I'm doing are not long enough for that. Ugh, that's not good. Don't get time to see what the difference is between us. Really annoying, I can't change the kilometres an hour to miles an hour. I must have hard coded it thinking, yeah, it's Europe, they use kilometres an hour. Yeah, no, we're weird. Apparently this game actually has split screen as well. I can imagine it probably drops the field size down by quite a bit though. Coming off on the halfway point. Got people from all angles around me. I cannot catch that guy ahead of me though. Oh, that was a smooth turn. That was good. I'm just losing so much time though. Actually, I'm not. He seems to be staying around four and a bit seconds. But, like, <laughs> my turns are not good. Oh, I'm all over the place here. I definitely lost time in that lab. Yeah, I may need to turn... The oh, I can't turn the AI down though, can I? Too far into the... into things. I mean, I could not save the season and restart. But hey, maybe I'll use it as a guide on how well I'm actually managing to drive. If I can start to catch these guys during the course of playing the game a bit more. Coming up on the halfway point of the race. See those guys, like, they tried to come past me and then just dropped way back again. It's really weird. I don't know how I did that lap time before. I'll tell you what though, this game is not something you can play for extended periods of time, because it uses the old D-pad. After constantly mashing that, yeah, his thumbs start to get tired. I cannot get anywhere close to these guys now. And I seem to be losing time each lap. Yeah, there's 6.7 seconds ahead now. I got this. Uh, slightly better on that split. Wait, they'll come flying past on the straights, but they seem to be way quicker, but for some reason I have better running the corners. It doesn't help though, because they're ridiculously quick on the straights. Probably the slipstream, to be fair. So I'm kind of stuck in a limbo where they can't get past me. And I can't catch the guys ahead because they haven't got the slipstream to do so. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this now, though. Hey, this lap. This lap's not looking too bad in terms of fastest lap, he says, as he drives it straight into the wall. That was clever. That's ruined it. Yeah, that cost me a lot of time, that did. Oh, so close to going in the back of him there. Let's see if I can get some slipstream. But there is a huge difference in speed when I get a slipstream. No wonder they're coming straight past me on the straights. But look at the difference that's just made. That is insane. Like, I might actually set a fastest lap here. Oh, close. Let's see what I mean though. Like, because I've lost the slipstream from before, I've just kind of been left in this limbo in ninth position. 
which to be fair, for my second, not first race, it's not too bad, but... They definitely put a lot of effort into the car liveries in this. There is <laughs> the track popping in and out is awful. They definitely put a lot of the uh, processing power towards the cars, which is understandable. But environments are definitely a big part of games. Go away. Whoever you are, I think you're Jeff Gordon. Ugh. That wall scrape. Ah, there goes everyone again. Oh, I can't turn because I'm in this slipstream. Oh, that's not ideal. Not doing too bad then. Damage is okay. How has he managed to do that? Cheater. Oop, bit of a slide into the corner. The slipstream really catches me off guard. Ugh. Because it definitely gives a huge speed boost. Uh, and sometimes it's not very, uh, not very useful. I've set a new, uh, new split time in sector one there. Back past him we go. Ah, oh, that's a beautiful turn. Almost a personal best lap. That goes nine seconds down the road now, though. Jeez. I think I almost need to keep the gas on to make sure the car actually turns. It doesn't seem to do too well in terms of turning. Um, if I don't have the gas on. This race seems to have flown by all of a sudden. Just four more to go. Oh, come on, kick it out the wall. There you go. That was far from the ideal line through that corner. Yeah. So I might be like in the action. Overtaking people, having some good races, but it <laughs> seems to be more uh, seeing people slightly come past and then disappear again. Oh, I held that turn really well. Last lap. Well, coming up on two. And the crowd goes wild as he comes round to win the race. Oh, wait, hang on. Never mind. They don't seem to be cheering for me. Slow final corner, that. And across the line. At least I finished the race. That's the main thing. Las Vegas 400. So I do believe I finished ninth there. Yeah. Oh wow, lost 10 seconds behind those guys. That's a big difference. Well, that's it for, uh, for part number one. Let's have a quick look where we are in standings. We're 15th, 136 points behind. So join me next time 
for part number two.